way. Already? It is time, inmate.
That's fine. You should be grateful. I guess that's fine. You should be grateful. I guess that's fine. You should be grateful. I guess that's fine. Oh, that's a very serious... Okay, that's good. Mm, do I get... Must be scheming to do something. That's what does that. something. Uh, come again. What's up? Good.
later. Ah, you're back. Next time, then. What you want? You always draw this. This is your pop such one. Are you finished? It is time, inmate.
Yes! We will entrust this to you, Haru. Okay. I place this in my father's study, and the treasure will appear, correct? If he notices the calling card, then yes. Are you afraid of doing this to your own father? To be honest, a little. Try to recall your anger. It will guide you in the right direction. So we're carrying out this plan tomorrow? All right. No staying up late tonight, then. We can laugh or cry all we want, but we only get one shot at this. Everyone, I'm counting on you. Sir Kunikazu Okumura, the great profiteering sinner of greed. Your success and global fame exists due to the tyranny you reign over your employees. Thus, we have decided to make you confess all your crimes with your own mouth. Hm. From the Phantom Thieves. I must take care of this before it becomes a problem. I've received a calling card from the Phantom Thieves. I need you to send it over to the police. Don't make me repeat myself. Give it to the police. That's an order. These scoundrels have threatened me. Aren't the police supposed to side with law-abiding citizens? I will not fail. This matter is urgent. Take care of it at once. I need to let everyone know about this. Hey!
Oh, have you heard? I need an answer. Figured out when we're gonna do it? This is different from normal. He has some nerve delivering the calling card to the police himself. Either he's certain his heart won't be changed, or he's colluded with the police from the beginning. As strange as it is for me to say, I could see that being the case. Whoa, the comments are coming in hot. Look! Take him down, Phantom Thieves. I don't care what the Phantom Thieves do as long as they show up, haha. -ha. Just do it quick, lol. They're just saying whatever they want. At this point, all they care about is seeing those in power beg for forgiveness. Damn it, this isn't a game! The means and the ends have been reversed. We're starting to be seen purely as entertainment. But we gotta do this! We can't just drop everything now! Considering the existence of the palace, his desires are indeed distorted. In a sense, the earlier we pull the root, the better. And given the issue concerning Haru's fiance, we don't have another choice in the matter. If we don't, then everything we've been doing up until now would just be for nothing. I believe this is best too. After hearing my father speak, I saw no remorse in him. Ryuji and Haru are right. Honestly, everything the public is talking about does bother me a little. But Okumura may just be the one behind the mental collapses. We can't leave this be. I feel like he's hiding something. Something big. True. And we already sent the calling card after all. Let's do this like we always do. And steal his palace's treasure! Treasure! 
Reveal your true form. Hey, 
Wait up! There! Well, looks like we caught up to you, Mr. CEO. I... I'm sorry. I've had a change of heart. I'll prove it. Father... Haru, you were always so agreeable. Whether it was in school or after, you only ever did as I said. You've become so admirable. What's gotten into him? Ah, oh, yes. Do you remember, Haru? You cried your eyes out when my work kept me from attending your first sports day. It was then that you stopped talking back to me. Honestly, you had me worried. Still, you stood up against me and became an independent young woman. Nothing could make a father happier than seeing that. You still remember something that happened so long ago? Back then, you poured your heart into making delicious food. You wanted to bring joy to others. Why did you change? <laughs> Forgive me, Haru. But I would never last if my treasure was stolen. Please, don't do it. I'm begging you. Father, let's... Let's end it here. Ah, Haru. You foolish girl. What? Overcome failure at any cost, even if it means betraying others. That is our family motto. The cold reality of kicking people down is part of business. Virtues and sentiments are for losers. What happiness can be found in acting with justice but losing the battle? What happiness can be found through profit, gained by crushing the hearts of others? Better that than fail. I'd much rather destroy others than wallow in the misery of debt. Regardless, I shall soon set sail into the political realm. To the upper echelons of the world. To Utopia. My name shall be etched in the annals of history. Make your decision, Haru. If you cast them away, I'll let you join me on this ship. Stay and you will be incinerated along with this entire base. Now then, what is your choice? You fool. Noir! What about you, there? Don't you want to get out of here alive? Want to board my ship? You're fighting against the others, are you not? Huh. So you were spying on us. You'll gain nothing by staying with them. That's what you believe, isn't it? You are absolutely right. Sell them out. Cut them off for your own personal gain. I'll even give you the switch once we take off. So, do we have a deal? I'll give you ten seconds. Time is money after all. Take me for such a fool. Everything's gains and losses for you, isn't it? I pity you, Mr. CEO. You lived with Haru for 17 years and you still haven't realized? In this world, there are tons of things that money and fame can't buy. What point would there be in only saving myself? <laughs> Nobody could replace these guys, period. You know what that means? Your offer was a no-go from the start! What? Whoa, Whoa, it hit! Ha. Way to go, me! Wowza! You're so cool, Mona! <laughs> you stole the show, man! <laughs> Father... So much for the negotiation. <laughs> you rebels. There is time before launch. I will crush you all! Very well, then. Bring it! You little! You won't get out alive! The power of the Kura Foods! It's time you surrender, Father! Give up? 
Try saying that after you've taken down my company's elite soldiers. No! There are more? Go, my employees! Be the foundation upon which my victory is built! Joker, you're looking good. Come. Countdown starting again. Take him down before it finishes. Go. Not that again, right? Okay, you might have to have to on your power even higher. Time to work. Every problem can be solved with more manpower. That is the strength of my company. Happiness based on the sacrifices of others isn't true happiness. Persona! There! Persona! Not bad, Mona. Wait, this part is all! Come, workers! Vicious foe! It's just not a psychokinetic really? skill! Two shadows knocked down! Go for broke Noir! Touch them, Melody! You got him, Noir! Right in the weak spot! Let's go! There! are not fit for the job. Executive Director, come to me. Come, workers! Now then, fulfill your duty as my right-hand man. For the eternal prosperity of Okumara Foods! 
Flip him, Persona! company rests upon how hard you work. For the eternal process. Forsaken even by her own employees. Let's end this, Joker. Persona! Shall we? It's a step forward. Check 
out this new skill. This new skill suits me. <laughs> what a skill. Just one more in a lineage of failures. I will contact your fiance and rescind the marriage offer. This may be the end for Akura Foods. Forgive me, Haru. Father! <laughs> you were behind all the breakdowns and mental shutdowns, weren't you? I admit I spent large sums of money to help my company grow and to crush business competitors. Answer me, damn it! Did you do it or not? Not personally. I had a contract. All I did was make the requests to have them eliminated. Requests? Then there really is a mysterious criminal in people's palaces after all. So it's true. What kind of contract did you form? And with whom? <laughs> Come on, stop crying and tell us! Warning! Damn it, why now? Mr. CEO, can't you stop that thing? Oh well. We can't just throw our lives away like this. Look, up there! We've taken your treasure. Huh? There's one more thing you need to tell us. Have you seen this criminal's face before? We don't got time to get that out of him! We'll just have to inquire about it back in the real world. Panther! Shouldn't we bring Father with us? Don't worry, he'll be fine. We'll end up dead if we're not out of here soon, though. Only you can follow through on your own responsibilities. That is what you've taught me, Father. My... Utopia. Make it? Probably not. Actually, I think it's impossible! We're counting on you, Mona! Still pounding. Uh, we did a great job in there. You know, Morgana, you seemed almost normal when you took the treasure. Oh? The truth behind the mental shutdowns remains unsolved, though. Okumura wasn't the culprit. Still, he did mention requesting people to be eliminated. He has to know who's responsible. Hmm. Mom. Is this... His treasure... was a plastic model kit? What's the matter? I remember Father telling me something before he changed. He said there was a model kit he really wanted back when he was a child. But no matter how much he begged my grandfather, he never got it. Your family could get like a thousand of those kits though. Okumura Foods has been around for generations. But it was a small company until my father took over. My grandfather was a good man, 
but not the best businessman. He'd even lend money with no collateral. It seems the debt collectors were a frequent presence when my father was young. Well, that must be why. Why Okumura was so willing to pursue his own happiness at the expense of others. Whoa! This thing's insane! It is a staggering price. I've heard this can happen to collector's items, but still. People are gonna pay that much for a plastic toy? By the way, when exactly is the change of heart supposed to happen? Soon. That's all we know. We'll just have to wait and see what happens until then. Once he has his change of heart, we'll surely be able to find out who's behind the mental shutdowns. Yes. Exactly as you planned, sir. Everything. From the Phantom Thieves targeting Okumura, to them changing his heart. We've lost a convenient source of income, but I'd rather not risk his connection coming to light. Okumura was not fit for the political world to begin with. He should have just behaved himself. Of course, without fail, sir. I've requested that he handle the matter. Arrangements have been made. A sudden mental shutdown will occur at just the right time. We'll dispose of our disappointing connection and the Phantom Thieves at once. Two birds with one stone. <laughs> I've actually been thinking a bit about my actions this time. I was way too worried about who I am and how I don't compare to the other members of our group. Turns out I just don't have any guts, huh? Thanks. I think the reason I was so hung up on wanting to be human is because I needed a goal of my own. Well, not a goal per se, but something bigger. I guess more like... a reason to live. But now that I'm sure I belong with the Phantom Thieves, I know what I want to do. Do you know what it is? To eventually. I'm going to do whatever I can to make sure the Phantom Thieves succeed. In other words, our goals are in alignment. From now on, I'm not going to hold anything back. You'd better put some effort in too. Don't make me regret my choice. Plus, I want Lady On to be happy. If my actions can help her achieve happiness, that's more than enough for me. I hope you're not thinking about how sappy all of this is. Looks like we made a great miscalculation, inmate. Contrary to our assumptions, it seems you have turned out to be quite promising. Your powers continue to grow, as do the relationships you hold with your contractors. It seems the rehabilitation is proceeding at a fine rate. <laughs> Allow me to warn you on one matter. 
Being at the peak may mean you are mere moments from your downfall. Unexpected situations are necessary in a game, after all. <laughs> All right. Why don't you try? Let's go. Hey! Oh. Well then. Ah, you're back. 
back. thinking about what Akiyama kun said to me how I've changed for some reason I couldn't bring myself to run away back when I saved him so I was thinking why that may have been honestly I was pretty desperate at the time so I don't remember much but in the back of my head I was thinking what you would do in that situation I mean you put yourself in a line to stop Kamoshida and probably other villains too so I thought there had to be something I could do myself. <laughs> I was only acting out of fear, though. You know, I've always wanted to change. I wanted to go from the dull nobody everyone messes with to the famous world-renowned hero. But you helped me realize something important. Heroes aren't heroes because they're famous. It's because they fight for other people. Looking back on it, what I really wanted to change was the weak me. The me on the volleyball team who let wrongdoing go unpunished, even though I knew it was unjust. The cowardly me who looked the other way when people I knew were in need of help. Tell me the truth. I only changed because you stole my heart, right? Huh? So the Phantom Thieves didn't make me have a change of heart? Really? Huh. But you know what? It's still thanks to you that I was able to change. All this time, I've been looking up to the Phantom Thieves, pretending to be a collaborator. And now, I'm finally able to stop pretending. Truth be told, I had given up. I accepted that I was a zero, that my existence was meaningless. But I've learned. I may not be able to change the world, but I can change myself. Whether I sulk about my inability to do anything, or hang my head high and look to the future. My perception shapes the boundaries of my world. It all comes down to what's inside my heart. I might still mess up every so often, but as long as you're here, I'll be able to stand up again. So, I may not be the best person around, but you can feel free to rely on me at least sometimes. And no matter what the world says, I'll be rooting for you, just like you were for me. blood oath. Thy bond shall become the wings of rebellion and break the yoke of thy heart. Thou hast awakened to the ultimate secret of the moon, granting thee infinite power. All right. You know what? I'm going to find you an awesome request. That's all I can really do for you right now. But I'm working on that documentary, too. I even plan on making it into a book someday. I'd bet anyone who reads about the Phantom Thieves would find the hidden courage within themselves. Maybe that means I can use that book to change people's hearts. All right, I'm on it. Oh, but before that, I'm hungry. Come on. Let's grab a bite to eat on the way home. Maybe a buffet? Wait, no. We should save that for after I get all my book royalties. <laughs> you better be looking forward to it.
No way, man. Hi, everyone. Well... What do you want to do? By the way, oh. Ah, you're back.
Yes. Oh, that's right. See you later. You okay with this? Select the skills you'd like to inherit. Will it gain new power? My, my. Persona, indeed. Select the skills you'd like to inherit. It will receive some new... Then let us begin. some protection. Finished, you'd like to read the compendium. Read here. These are the paths you have walked. Is this what you want? A fee is required. This is your power. Are you finished? No slacking off! Good. 
See ya. Sandal has come undone! You're too slow! Unless you can move at the speed of light, you'll never be able to go back to the future!
What? I just cannot understand. You. I was wrong about you. Does it matter who likes someone first? What are you talking about? There's a boy I like, but my friend told me that I have to let her have him because she liked him first. Oh, that's not true. Really? Then why did she say that? It's likely because she's jealous of you. Just be careful because it might result in pandemonium. Pandemonium? That girl's gotten a lot better. So much so, in fact, that now she's gossiping. She even comes in on days she doesn't have to. It appears she's nearly fully recovered. Which reminds me, the new medicine will be completed soon. Your data has been extremely helpful due to your generic body type and bland health history. You've been a splendid guinea pig. I mean, participant. So thanks again. By the way, how have I been doing? Have I been helpful? For your escapades with the Phantom Thieves, I mean. Come on. You and I both know that you were lying about needing to prepare for the entrance exams. I visited Oyamata in jail. A swing of fortunes like that could have only come at the hands of the Phantom Thieves. And to have it happen when it did, isn't the only logical conclusion to think that it's you? <laughs> well, I don't care. The point is that without you, I wouldn't have been able to complete my mission. I would have never finished the new medicine while I was being deceived by Oyamada. And I would have never met any of the townspeople. I bet the Phantom Thieves save people in need just like doctors do, huh? So, I'll go out on a limb for you. I'll have even more powerful medicine ready for you. I trust that you'll use them appropriately. I am thou, thou art I. Thou hast turned a vow into a blood oath. Thy bond shall become the wings of rebellion and break the yoke of thy heart. Thou hast awakened to the ultimate secret of death, granting thee infinite power. All right. All right. I'm not going to give them to you for free, though. 
so you better make some money in the name of justice. <laughs> now go. Take care. Ah, you're back. here for today. Welcome. Hmm. 
Well then. Well, shall we begin? Well... What do you want to do? Searching all along, can 
Make sure you close up. Hi. Hide in both face and mind. All free for you to draw. I'm a chef shifter. That's Textbooks open to page. What is the answer? This is it. Correct. I should write something. <laughs> 